Hey everybody, this is Dean DeCosta, and today we're talking about the IntelliSearch OSINT tools, in this case, the username tools. This involves different usernames. Now, in my case, I'm going to put in one of my usernames, which is Pro43. We're going to populate all. As you can see, it populates every single solitary one of these. And what we're going to try to do is try to decide, hey, is there a chance that um, this particular username is on that particular site? Now, we're going to start up here. It says Noam, this thing, which is going to search specific sites. So let's see. Let's pick a Noam and see what Noam brings us. It's going to open up Noam and it's pre-populated Pro43 already and down here it's telling you what's available and what's not in the blogging space for Pro43. As you can see eBlogger is not. I happen to have that one. That is mine. Um, WordPress is also not available. That happens to be mine as well. And then, of course, you can do all the others, but these are the biggies. If you want to search all of these categories, and as you can see, they're still loading, you can just go ahead and do the search up here for social networks, most popular domain, trademark, but that's unknown, but you started here. Now, what would happen if we try an email search? Let's do an email search because it's a username I use, Pro43. Do I have an email associated? Well, guess what? I do right there on my LinkedIn page. Here's another one, email Sherlock has me. Here's a work work daily.com recruiter dean DeCosta, that's me and look there's my email so there you go you can legitimately just have a username use this tool to go ahead and find the person with that username it's really cool really simple really easy to use and there you go Th that's it this is uh the um intella intella techniques osint custom custom user name tools and i'm dean DeCosta.